clowns and the elephants are what you hang your circus on. You know who said that? No. Oh, the shame of you. Don't you feel bad that you don't know who said that? Well, it was P.T. Barnum, just so you know. P.T. Barnum said that. Said clowns and elephants are the thing you hang your circus on. To keep the pace up and cover for costume and scene changes, a skillful diversion tactic is required. And that's the time to send in the clowns. As rehearsals near their fourth week, timing of the performances becomes more crucial. If you want something done, do it yourself! Each of the 22 different acts that make up the two-hour and 20-minute show must fit within its allotted time. Timing is everything. Timing is everything, especially when it comes to clowning. Thank you! Good night! All right. Oh, so this was 3.20, and we have four minutes for this. That means we have 40 seconds, which we can apply to the uh, piano gag, which happens in the second half, and we're over there by at least a minute. So 40 seconds, we're back in the ball game. Good work. Today's really exciting for us, because we're seven days from opening, and our performers have been given their wardrobe to wear. So we'll have them come out looking pretty spiffy, and most importantly, we'll see if they can make their costume changes or not. While they may appear to be somewhat of an afterthought, the 18 performers that comprise Clown Alley are actually some of the most important cogs in the circus's big wheel. Clowns are very important to a circus. They're extremely important to a circus because they are the audience's connection with what's going on. Would you not agree with that? I would definitely agree with Thank that. Thank you very much. And without clowns, what would you have? You'd just have everything else. Well, that would be a lot. But the point is, is that the audience would just sit there and go, <laughs> whereas clowns, we are the connection. We bring the audience in and make them a part of the whole grand spectacle that is a circus. 